if this even uh, works because I have like two bars of LTE. Cool little river right there. Anybody have a very buffered screen or what do we got going on? Good morning. We are drinking coffee on the dock. How are you guys doing? Good morning, Trucker John. How you doing? What's it like? Is it bad audio? How's the, uh, the picture? What up, Alan? How you guys doing? Good morning. Thanks, Tim. Thanks, Frank. Robert, what's going on? Shoestring Trucker, what's going on? What's up, Dan? James Best, you doing up so early, man. Gary, what's going on? We got the sun coming up over the horizon, and we got a morning cup of joe. How's the, uh, how's the, um, picture in the audio, guys? Good morning, Sheepdog. Good morning, Dustin. What's going on, Gearhead? George, what's going on? <laughs> yeah, we're blessed to be out here. It's a beautiful lake house. Art Octavius, headed to uh, drop off heavy Niagara. There you go, man. Pre-trip at 10 a.m. There you go, shoestring. That's beautiful. Thanks, Sam. Saudi Arabia, what's up, Peter? How you doing? My cat is probably down underneath that Trans Am at home. The lake life is awesome. That's right, Cecil. Nice wake up today. There you go, Matthew. Get, get, get some good sleep. South Mississippi. Ronald, what's going on? Lee, good. So you guys can hear it. Good, good. Thanks a lot, Lee. You're the first person to <laughs> comment that. Audio, good. Thanks a lot, James Best. That movie was hilarious last night. When they pulled the trucks together, I was like, wow. And then when they were hitting each other at the end and they were fake trucks. If you guys have no idea what I'm talking about, James, uh, it's a movie called Ice Road on Netflix. What's up, Byron? What's up, Cecil? Raccoon Lake. There you go. Tyler, thanks a lot. Good morning, Columbia, South Carolina. What's up, Patrick? You got the same probably weather I got because you're... Columbia is that way about 140 miles. Matt G, what's going on? Dave, John Last, Stuart, what's up, buddy? Can't beat the view, man. McKinney, what's up? Michael Perry, what's going on? Alan, looks so calm. Yeah, this would be perfect. Uh, and it's nice. This house is the way they have it, man. That's where the cove stops right there. So you have, like, no boat traffic back here. It's awesome. So we took it out last night for a little sunset cruise. After, <laughs> you have to watch it. But <laughs> that's right, James Best. Dead Dog, what's going on, man? Good morning. We are watching this sunrise right here. I'm going to have to get rid of this uh, little spider web up here because my mom is deathly afraid of spiders, and she shows up today about noon. 12 o'clock here in the UK. There you go, Gregory. We are blessed to have such calm water and uh, got a cool little, uh, they put a little, like, river in right here. A little fountain that comes down. Pretty cool, huh? You should have seen me back in that trailer run yesterday trying to get it between the trees. Took me a while, but I, I got a, good, a lot of good experience, you know? <laughs> Not a big fan of that movie. It was over the, all the place right around. Jared, what's going on? Trucker John, how you doing? Thanks a lot, man. Jamel, that's right, man. We're really blessed to be out here, and uh, trucking's made it possible for us. South Dakota, what's up, Scott? You're up early. Michael, man, I, I'm jealous too. Wild Child, James Keaton, what's going on? Waving a hand, I'm gone. Fly fishing water there. Yeah, there's a bunch of little bugs on the water. Australia, what's going on, JB? Anderson, South Carolina, what's up, Scott? Mikkel, what's going on, man? Robert, thanks so much. I'm on Lake Kiwi. That's right, Robert and Lanier. Yeah, it is beautiful. The boys are having a blast. Uh, tank has already jumped off right here, probably about 300 times. <laughs> I forgot to turn the lights off last night. That's actually light, so at nighttime, it's all lit up in there. It's pretty cool. Let's turn those off. My bad. Houston, Texas. What's up, Christian? Xavier, what's up, man? Ben Narber, what's going on? 17K and a 70-hour clock. Awesome, Scott. I think it's one of these ones. Look at all the spider webs. Yeah, buddy. There we go. Let's see which one it is. No, nope, not that one. There you go. Sun is coming up, guys. Yeah, it was cool. You can, we were swimming a little bit last night, but it wasn't dark yet. 702 Trucker, what's going on, man? Coffee smells good. <laughs> I got it sitting on my little dock perch here. The water's so calm, it doesn't matter. That's a, that's a view right there, right? Morning coffee. But I figured, hey, if 
if I'm out here, why not show you guys a little lake life? South Carolina lake life. This is Lake Kiwi. It's about 30 miles, not 30 miles, maybe 25, 20 miles from uh, Greenville out to the west. Beautiful lake. Morning, what's up, Richard T-shirt? There you go. What's the Richard T-shirt? So, Jackie, think about what Richard uh, nickname for that could be. That's what, and you'll, you'll get it. Hickory, North Carolina, what's up, James? Uh, Jerry, I'm always up pretty early, man. Um, but when I'm on vacation, I'm always up a little bit earlier because I want to take in every moment, you know? Once one of my babies gets up, I got to go get in there and get them some cereal going. That's right, Best. You got to have something for the boat. You got to have your own slip. <laughs> Makes me want to move down that way. Gary, man, I never knew about the South until I married my wife and moved out here, and good golly. Truck of T-Bone, what's going on, man? Good morning. Eric, what's going on? Good morning. Dead Dog Rising, what's going on? Long time listener, first time caller. Try, uh, truck of Thought, if a chin holler and a cow holler, hot, hot head on, got head on, what do you get? Steak and eggs. <laughs> there you go, Dead Dog. Good, good, good one in the morning, buddy. Thanks a lot, Eric. Trinidad, 1982. Cloudy and Cross, Wisconsin. Man, you got to come down here and get a little bit of a on second cup. There you go, Cecil. Jerry, understand that. There you go, Jerry. Hello from America, Bonnie and Scotland. Hey, Arda boy, Atta boy. Looks like beautiful morning. It's gorgeous. Yeah. Thanks a lot, Gene. A Aldi, what's going on? Nomadic Brent, what's going on, buddy? How you doing, man? Where's your morning looking like? Best time to go fishing. That's right. R Ralph, good morning. Raymond, what's going on? Ramon, what's going on, man? Good morning. Have a blessed week. You too, Scott. Jackie. Southern Maryland. There you go. All kinds of water around us. There you go. Uh, I got a lot of family in the cross. There you go. All right. For some reason, I think that the... Uh... We don't want that. Sorry, guys. It scared me a little bit. Because that is the... Uh... Might off to the side, and we couldn't figure out how to work that last night. But it just started airing up, so <laughs> that's the boat lift. And if it's li it's gonna it would lift my boat off to one side. So now that we know that it gets air, we might use it later. But uh, we couldn't figure it out yesterday. Whew. So I plugged it in last night, <laughs> but I just unplugged it <laughs> because it just started. Uh, once it fills with air, it'll fill up those uh, buoys underneath and lift your boat out of the water. So it's easier than docking, but uh, 65 and overcast, Wisconsin. There you go. Sorry, guys. That was a scare for me to hear that going off in the back. <laughs> I was like, please don't lift my boat up. <laughs> lift it sideways. David Watts, good morning, man. How you doing? Great day. Enjoy the family. That's right, buddy. North Carolina, one of my families for the day. Have a good week. You too, Michael. God bless you, man. Have a good weekend. Good morning from Ocala, Florida. What's up, AJ? Greensboro, what's up, Albert? 54 in Michigan? Wow. Yeah, Jerry, it sucks sometimes. Good morning from Hunterville. What's up, Steve? B inspection, day nice and cool. There you go. 65 right now. There you go, Amy. Louisiana just getting that workout in. Good job, KNS. Beach time for sure. Scotland, what's up, Danny? Dead dog rising. More smiles and go. Oh, there you go, man. Let's see what else we got. Sorry, I'm scrolling down, guys. Cold in Ohio, 51. There you go. This master, what's going on? Lee Solomon, 65 and 62 and foggy. Man, Lee. What's up, Andrew? How you doing? Punta Gorda, I love it down there. 80, 80 degrees. Brad, what's going on? Word up. What's going on, T-Bone? Coffee on me. Thanks a lot, Ralph. <laughs> Whatever happened to work ethics? <laughs> yeah, that's right, Jerry. Indonesia, what's going on, Aldi? Another beautiful day here in Florida as well. There you go. 118 in Saudi Arabia. Man, Peter. Patrick, I don't know. W9, I'm, uh, I just asked my buddy who actually um, did all the interior on this boat. I asked him, hey, man, would you, because he's really mechanical. I said, do you mind doing, he's got a YouTube called VAS Motorsports, V-A-S-S, -S, all one word. But I asked him, like, hey, man, I got some in my eye. <laughs> right when I turned the camera around. Um, I asked him, would you do the frame? And he said, um, I still got something there. You know when you got that little like blurred part in your eye? Like the, I got to get that out of here. You guys can watch the sunrise. Um, but he said, no, man, I don't have enough time. He's redoing a sea ray right now. Thanks a lot, Valentino. Val Valentro, just tuned in. What's up, AG Trucker? How you doing, man? 
Yeah, 118. <laughs> That's crazy. Illinois, 97, major change being home right now. Minnesota, how it going? What's going on, James? Maldives, MT. Oh, beautiful place, man. I think my eye's working again. Working again? There you go. No, it's right above Hartwell. It's uh, Kiwi. Lisa, Lisa, what's going on, Florida? Good morning. Good morning, Mike. How you doing? Yeah, insurance is somewhat straightened out. Um, only ones that are left that need to be done is Uber and Convoy, who use a system called RMIS, and um, they have to have an email directly from the broker so, or the insurance people. So Progressive emailed them, what was that, Wednesday. So it takes 48 hours, they say. So hopefully by Monday, we have it all up and running. And that was kind of my bad. I should have got it done before, but I thought I had that done when I was taking that load down to um, Charleston. Uh, what's left on W9, Jerry? But I didn't have it done. I, had, I thought she got it all done, but she didn't. W9, I just want the whole frame coated, uh, wire wheeled and coated. I could do it myself. I should do it myself, but I just, as you can see, I enjoy family a little bit. So, um, and, and then the sensors replaced. I might do all the uh, brake chambers replaced, just so I, I love it. And then the APU are getting it redone. And we're working with green APU right now from uh, one of our other buddies in, on YouTube, uh, other trucker James Best, suggested them, and they're actually working with us as a little sponsorship. Just got my there you go, Michael Parker. Congrats, man! Thanks for uh, helping out, man. Support the channel. Have to get to work. All right, Michael. T's and P's, man. Get, get safe out there, buddy. Roll easy. Art right, landscape, buddy. So, yeah, it's beautiful out here. We are getting a little sunrise. If you head around that tree to the right a little bit, and then that way. Um, there's a bridge and then there's a big opening. There's a restaurant over here. We're going to head up this way today and there's a little waterfall, a place to jump off down over there. Thanks a lot, uh, uh, James Best, OTJB. Sydney, Australia right now and we're still under lockdown for Delta. Jeez. Uh, hopefully the W9. Yeah, hopefully. I mean, it depends on the APU and the, me loving the suspension and then we're going to run it till we need to in-frame it and then we'll in-frame it. 17 he watches your videos awesome man james foster thanks for watching i love your channel such a great no, i would try to be brian louisville kentucky right by my mom looking to go live with vlox and nomad trucking this weekend justin maybe you'll catch oh, of course nomadic i love you guys man i love vlox too one of my favorite california truckers besides thor well my thor's from uh, utah but uh i love those california guys what else we got on here? What's going on, Freddy? Freddy ten four, Ricardo. What's going on, Lake Kiwi? That's right, Matthew. Kevin, hello, buddy. What's the cost of profit per load, and lo profit per load? Uh, Timothy, it varies. So this week I did uh, thirty five hundred to PA to, to Philly and back, and that was six hundred and twenty miles. <clears throat> and then I picked up a little eight hundred on the way home, and then I shut it down. So I got, and then they gave me four hundred and fifty extra. So let's say roughly four grand. I made. Forty-seven fifty. Um, let's see, yeah, $47.50 in two, in two and a half days, two days. And then we had 550 in fuel, so. We can't keep you all summer. There you go, Matthew, it's beautiful up here, man. Ricardo, good, man. AZ Cactus Flower, good morning. Good morning, salute to you. Rudy, Alabama, what's going on? Oh, yeah, another thing about this awesome house. They're actually selling this house. We're talking to them right now, seeing what they're doing. It needs a huge update inside. It's from 1975, but... Dirt, CV-19, lockdowns again. Dang, Papa Bear, Bear, I'm sorry, man. Yeah, not bad, Eric. I mean, if you keep that going all week, you could really make some money. Uh, there's still money to be made out there. That's right, Daddy and Papa. Or Papa. Oh, Daddy and Papa 3. There you go. Good Saturday morning. There you go, Shara. It's a beautiful way to wake up. Uh, good morning, watching before heading to the building to work. There you go, Mark Ford. Good morning, Randy. We may not have the same like things like Uber. I do like your content. In Australia, wait and talk. It still applies regardless of the industry. There you go. It's right, Michael Fitzgerald. It's exactly right. I'm in 14 home lockdown. Jeez. Oh, that's another thing. You guys, some of you guys uh, know that white truck that I have. That um, not the W9, but the Ram. And the poor guy got COVID. <laughs> I called him yesterday because it was like, a lot of you guys remind me of that. Put me in your will, Lake House. There you go, AZ Cactus. Um, Four dollars per gallon for diesel. Dang, Steve. We're we're at three bucks over here for South Carolina. Gary Jones, what's going on? Josh Jeffers, good morning, brother. There you go. Thanks a lot, Josh. 
I hope you have a great Saturday, buddy. Uh, Louisville, Kentucky, the channel's awesome. There's like, like that's right, uh, Roy. It's uh, 1.30 there, huh, Ricardo? Yeah, diesel is expensive, Lisa Lisa. 325 in Michigan. That's not too bad, James Foster. But yeah, the Ram, um, I called him yesterday, and he was, uh, he's got COVID, poor guy. <laughs> he's got another guy that works with him, but he's like, hey, man, the workload's a little bit crazy. We're turning people down right now, but we'll get you done. And uh, so it's crazy. And, but they have all the electrical done. They're just like tightening up everything, test driving it, and then hopefully next week. We always say hopefully, but there's no rush on it. I don't, I don't even know what we're doing next week. I think we're going, we're, we're, I'm gonna run all week, but I think Friday we're doing one more vacation before my oldest son, Cash. Josh Jefferson, I'm having a great Saturday watching my, there, thanks a lot, Josh. <laughs> um, uh, but yeah, he's going to school the week after that. So we're trying to like this lake house, the Great Wolf Lodge we're gonna go to next weekend, I believe. I don't know the dates, but probably Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And then um, UK, I hope family is safe, thanks a lot. Are you doing the poke? Yeah, James, I guess they have these little wands. So we bought Cash and Casey one, the four-year-old and the five-year-old, and then um, we got one for Tank just because he'd probably get mad and want theirs. So it's like 25 bucks, so we got him one too, just so he has his own. Um, I refuse to be muzzled. There you go. <laughs> yeah, great. I've never been to Great Wolf Lodge. We've been to another one up there. I don't know, somewhere in Gatlinburg area, like another one up towards uh, Knoxville. It was really awesome too. It was a, it was a Wyndham Resort that we stayed at. But um, Jay Foster, that's what everyone's saying. So I can't wait. And we got like a uh, a room with with two queens and a king and a sofa sleeper. So my mom can come if she wants, and uh, Gigi can come. I think Gigi's coming today with Papa to hang out at the lake house a little bit. We got the gardeners going on. And then uh, we're gonna go ahead and, more truckers to watch your videos just for you when you cut yourself some in. Oh, thanks a lot, De dead dog. It's it's uh, it's a little easier for me when I'm, I, I am blessed to, to make good money on most of my loads and, and negotiate the rate. So I try to teach people, hopefully they can do the same and also how to, um, how to, the, the powers in your court if you're, uh, if you have the load like that. We got some guys? I don't, Gary Jones, no second driver. Good after John, what's going on? Netherlands, how you doing? Oh, what time is it in the Netherlands? I love the Netherlands also. I've been to Amsterdam. I took the whole trip from Amsterdam down to Rotterdam, hit Bruges, hit Brussels, and then down to Paris and flew out. It was beautiful. I loved it up there. Such a cool environment. Took the train, never felt uh, unsafe. Just it was a great time. Decent Australia is a dollar fifty ish, four twenty a gallon. Wow. That's awesome, AJ. Florida. I mean, it's everyone's got their own view on it, but uh, I feel like I got that cough that I had in the pneumonia because I was wearing the mask. I felt like if I would have been able to breathe breathe a little better, I would have been fine. We catch any fish? I wish we were, Robert. <laughs> There's plenty of them out here, I'm sure. Plenty of them out here. One thirty in Netherlands, okay. Mississippi, what's up, Matt? How you doing? Where all you post on? Matt's one of our top posters on Facebook. How you doing, Matt? Thanks for... Uh, all the pictures you show. That cab over is pretty cool. Norway. Yeah, that'd be beautiful. I want to do Norway. Uh, Amy H., what made me want to be a truck driver? I just kind of um, fell into it. I was Uber driving out here in the south. And um, I picked up a guy who was a truck driver at a truck stop from his truck, took him home, and he was just talking to me. And I was, at the time, just starting to work for UPS for two weeks. And I went and uh, signed up for CDL school that weekend. Because <laughs> he said, hey, man, you get your CDL. There's a lot of jobs out here for it. And then I started to research it, and once I researched it, I saw how much money can be made in it. And a big shout out to Make Sense for um, teaching me the owner op way. And once I learned his ways, I said, okay, I'm just gonna go buy a truck and, and be an owner operator and sink or swim in this thing. And I think we're still swimming, but we're, we came close to sinking a couple times. <laughs> but we're still swimming as of right now. And thanks for all you guys for hanging out with us. And YouTube helps us do stuff like this, so we appreciate every one of you guys. Oh, that sun is starting to get in my face. COVID came, I think we got a joke right here. Uh, COVID came from a bat, it was dinner yet. It was told he could catch it from food, huh? Which it is, which is it? I don't know. Ontario, what's going on? How you doing, Steven? EEL, nice sunrise, thanks a lot. Ever seen a trailer where the tandems and set can be raised? No, I haven't, Patrick, that's pretty cool. 
Yeah, metal metal detecting Ohio. We found that out a couple, what, three or four days ago. It's a teasing piece for him. He was only in his 20s, I think 27. Up in Virginia, poor guy. Teasing piece to his family. Can happen to any of us. 4.30 a.m. Vancouver, Canada. Too hot. <laughs> Watching the lake. There you go. Danny Yoder, what's going on? How you doing, buddy? I have thought about it. If I had money, it would buy me a 500 acres up in Knoxville. There you go. Yeah, Jeffers, that's a beautiful place up there. Uh, life of a traveler. We're doing great. We're uh, enjoying the coffee with the sunrise. I thought I'd bring it to you. It was too pretty not to. How did I choose my rigs? Jerry, I just chose Cummins. And I heard Volvo just had a great ride, had a great, um, you're welcome, Amy H. Great ride and it was a pretty reliable truck for like electronics and stuff like that, not breaking. Um, and so I was looking for it. And I was actually asking my instructors in school, like, hey, should I get a Volvo? Like I was really dead on asking them like, what's this and that about trucks? And they were like, just go work for company. Uh, don't buy ever buy a Volvo. And I'm like, all right. <laughs> and my Volvo has only had me down for six, seven days total. Uh, which was six of them were um, uh, me rebuilding the entire motor. So still in bed, morning in Montana. There you go, Daniel, or Missouri. Winning the lottery and your dream car. Get to winning the lottery and your dream car can become reality. There you go, Barry. <laughs> Huntington Beach. Oh, my God. I love it out there, Howard. I used to go down Brookhurst every, every chance I got. And, uh. Amber and David, we're at Lake Kiwi, South Carolina, about a 50-minute drive from the house. And, uh, yeah, I used to go down to Brookhurst all the time and, and uh, hit the beach with my brother. Love that beach. AJ, go on fishing. There you go. You too, AJ. Have a good time, man. Working today, second shift resin plant. There you go, Ron. Thanks for, thanks for working hard out there. Small company driver, treat your company as, as your own. There you go. Drive a 219 Globetrotter XL. There you go, dead dog. Do you miss? Do you miss in and out? I do, Patrick. When we so I got T Dubs when we lived in uh, the West, which Arizona has in and out now for three years with me. And whenever we go back, she's like, "We're getting in and out." <laughs> I'm like, "All right, you're hooked. I love it." Oh, Missouri. Sorry, Danny Yoder. What maintenance do you have coming up? Brakes on trailer yet? AC Cactus. When I bought that trailer, those brakes are brand new, so they're not even 50 percent right now. But uh, I have a brand new, the only maintenance you're really going to have on your, is your hubs and your, your um, drums, your brakes, tires. But I have also that little uh, four-way quick release valve, the, the, the uh, air valve for the trailer, just in case that goes somewhere in the middle of nowhere, I can replace it myself. It's only like $60 part. 600 horsepower red top, N14, there you go. Clarence, what's going on, buddy? Guys at the shop tuned my truck to 575. There you go, Eric. Good morning from Texas. What's up, Jerry? We're hanging out with the uh, gardeners next door. And we got a little, there's a little cool little uh, stream fountain they put right there. So I got to figure out why that thing turned back on. The Mag Brick editing some video, trying to spin a YouTube. There you go, man. It's, it's fun. It's crazy. T Dubs, it's like a way of our life now. I'll be sitting there on my phone just clicking away and she because i do all my editing on my phone and she's like you're editing a video huh i'm like yep <laughs> or if i don't respond to her i'm loading a video <laughs> where's the bobber at i don't know oh you mean for fishing okay no fishing i should be getting something right now i should be getting breakfast for t-dubs my mom is uh probably driving down here right now there you go clarence working hard baby practicing papa beer papa bear hopefully <laughs> hopefully one day we can retire Third week of CDL classes, any tips? Remember, oh, I'm gonna try and help you out there, man. Uh, any tips on remembering order of PTI pre tour Yeah, I would memorize it every morning before I walked into class. I would sit there with the, with the, uh, with the paper and just memorize a different part of it and try to w say it back to myself without looking at the paper. So, I mean, that's how I, yeah, I use Splice Daisy Cactus, um, but that's how I do that. I memorize by r repeating it to myself and then and trying to see if I get it right. So it depends on how you memorize stuff, but that's all it is, is memorization. And then break it up into groups, break it up into the safety of getting into the cab and doing your air down and then break it into when you get out of the truck. So that's how I did it. I did, I'd, I would test myself or have a buddy test me inside the cab and then getting out. That's right, dead dog, beautiful out here. Truck and T-Bone, that's right, buddy. I use iMovie whenever I bring a movie in from uh, 
GoPro, I have to iMovie edit, iMovie edit it to um, get the sound for some reason. Back up to the plant, Ennery picking up 5,000 gallons of glue. There you go, Nomadic. You'd be right by the house, man. If you ever come by 385, stop by, man. Um, 579 Cummins. But yeah, uh, shoot, what were you saying, T-Bone? Uh, yeah, I use Diesel. What's going on? Good morning, brother, from Australia. Uh, did you have your baby yet, Diesel? Everybody teasing peace for Diesel. He's having his baby. Uh, his wife's getting induced right now, so teasing peace to you, Diesel. You and Beth. Uh, Michael McGray, good morning, buddy. There you go, Nomadic. Yes, sir. Um, but what were we talking about? T-Bone, yeah, I use iMovie whenever... Now my um, GoPro footage is actually coming through without being super, like, slow-mo, but it has no sound, so I have to iMovie edit each one of them. That's why I still don't use a lot of GoPro. Yes, man. Baby boy, congrats, Diesel. There you go, man. That's a huge blessing. So Diesel was was having the baby without um, without knowing the sex, so he's got a baby boy now. Congrats, man. So, uh, yeah, but then I use GoPro, I switch it to iMovie, and then whenever I do anything with my drone, I have to iMovie it to add the, um, the um, sound and stuff. So, congrats, Diesel. That's awesome, man. Another baby boy in this world. Right around the age of my three crazy boys are, are probably stirring around right now in the house. So, I'll probably get, get off here in about another four or five minutes. We'll get a good 30 minute live. Diesel had a baby boy. Congrats, man. Where's my fishing pole? That's right, Tom. So, uh, yep, uh, but I use iMovie and I use Splice. I had to use Splice. I was only using iMovie in the beginning. Uh, you're welcome, Amy. Thanks a lot for showing joining. Green Finland, what's going on? Thanks a lot, Mag uh, MacGyver. Athrun's blowing. Air horn's blowing for diesel. There you go. Another baby boy out there in Australia. Thanks a lot, AZ Cactus Flower. But yeah, it's uh, editing. Splice makes it pretty easy, but it is a little bit of time out of my day editing. But I, I try to make the best stuff I can make to teach people and show you this beautiful countryside and show you the good and the bad. <laughs> uh, especially when old glory's flying. Yes, Danny Yoder, we do. Looks, I mean, you can kind of see a little bit of it right... It's, it's getting better, but it was pretty dang bad. I need a train horn. There you go. Uh, my Dub 9 has a nice horn. Like, Mrr. my uh, Volvo has a generic. Uh, it's still an air horn, but it's not as a. Uh... There you go, dead dog. One up, baby. Thanks. <laughs> Valdez, T's and P's, man. Do, do your best. Memorize that pre-trip. That's half the battle, man. And just stay your speed. Check your mirrors, and you'll be fine, man. You got this. Second job money. There you go, Perry. Need a train horn. There you go. Diesel family, man. Continue to God. Continue to, uh, to bless you. Wild child said it. I'm going. There you go, James Keaton. Oh, dead dog for Diesel. Thanks a lot, man. Is the truck giveaway done? No, R Rudy, it's not till December, buddy. So everything, uh, we got new shirts coming out. I keep saying that. We tried to do a video the other day, but we got home. I took the boys to the pool real quick. Threw them around. Played with T-dubs. Swam for a little bit, and by the time I got out of the pool, I didn't have enough sunlight for the video. I have an, a concept of what I want to do, and it'll be coming. Old school train horns are like a whistle. I'm not sure. Put a train horn on a W9. Maybe, Reno. <laughs> I don't know. But the horns that are on it right now, it's that typical, like the nice uh, old school horn. There you go, Jeff. How you doing? Good morning, buddy. Grew up on a farm driving a W9. There you go, Michael Parker. Friend wanted to get in a truck, and there you go. My parents had a ground... Knoxville, March last year. This is almost Kentucky to bury my last. Oh, sorry, Josh. Rest in peace for her, baby. Nice name. There you go, Master. Another truck driver for Diesel. There you go, Jerry. Yeah, Jerry, he's got one son driving for him already. He's got Bugatti. What's going on, man? Thanks, brother. But yeah, he's already got one son driving with him. He's, uh, he's restarting. We'll have another baby boy. Sam, what's going on? Have a good day to you, too. Who does your shirts? Jerry, there's a, every morning of every video, if you ever watch a video, it says, um, thanks a lot, James Foster. It says Kaz Gear right after my little intro, and um, that's the company. He's up in uh, Casadona, New York, upstate New York. Awesome guy named Brian. Yeah, Rudy, you can, buddy. Steam horn, there you go, Robert. Old school truck horns, there you go. There you go, Domatic, we're trying, man. We're just trying to. Show everybody the good and the bad of the trucking industry. It's, it's not an easy job, but no job out there is. So at least we can 
have it like people were saying in uh whose live feed last night i think it was bees knees trucking live feed he was saying there's no ceiling in trucking there really there really isn't i mean you can grow, grow your fleet as big as you want swift trucking started uh, uh husband wife um back in the day okay i think that light's still on down there maybe i messed that up with the underwater light still on maybe that's what that switch was but yeah there's no ceiling in trucking so it's, it's a great part of it yeah, there's a lot of bad parts and there's a lot of good parts i have to get rid of all these spider webs before I walk my face through one of them. Uh, 31 years driving. There you go. A million miles. Out. Congrats, Brian. If I could buy a truck, what would it be? Let me get back to that comment. Uh, what other YouTube channels? I watch all the trucking YouTube channels, man. I'm a big uh, advocate of know your industry, know the people around you, so I watch them all just to see what they're saying, what they're doing with, what they're going through. Uh... If I could have any truck, it would be a Max Superliner. There you go. Old school EM9. You're talking trucks? I don't know, man. You must be overseas. Uh, Burmerson, Washington. What's up, Johnny? How you doing, brother? Off to work now. There you go, metal detecting. God bless you, man. Thanks for working on Saturday. Brandon, Texas does that and more. Sorry for my finger being away, guys. Over an hour away from me. There you go, James. Some subs. Next way, be like, yeah. There you go. Uh, what was that? Be nice to throw some subs and Nixon Vlox. Yeah, of course, man. Vlox, I think someone said he had a great video. Uh, let's see if this switch turns that light off. I don't know. I think that switch turned on the uh, turned on this air thing right here, but I just turned that off. Let's see if that turned the light off underneath the water. I don't know. If it wasn't on, I don't think it was on last night. Let's see. Nope, still on. <laughs> if you can kind of see it down there, that's a light that... Uh, you can see for swimming, but uh, whatever. That's sad. Yeah, boss, man, it's really sad. Watching Trucker's uh, Wife for years. I love watching you and your family. Thanks a lot, Renee. Oregon's beautiful, too. Huntington, West Virginia. Hey, what's going on? At Mountain Man, I was up there, man. I delivered one time up there. Beautiful up there. Uh, right off that river. Jack, thanks a lot, man. You, too. Greetings from Louisiana. Hope you have a great day. Thanks a lot, AJ. That's right, Steve. He's responsible for everything. Responsible for this blue sky and that beautiful sun. So that's right. Freight line. I would have a freight liner. There you go. Well, the newer freight liners have a couple, some issues going on. Some of the tube truckers out there having some problems with them. I love your videos. Have a beautiful family. Thanks a lot, Richard. Art Escape Adventures by Lisa. Let me know if the, uh, I might go live again tomorrow morning, but let me know if the, uh, my coffee's a little bit cold. Vlogs and Nomadic Truck over the week. I will, Nomadic. God bless, man. We'll walk through here. We might get a little bit choppy. I don't know if the, the internet's good, but um, since my mid 80s. There you go, AC Cactus. Steve, thanks a lot, man. What's cool? We got a little seating. This house is really well done. Just needs just needs updating. <laughs> Arizona, what's up? Uh, Wicked SUS. Propped near a lake. Moss problem on the house. Ah, oh, there you go. We got a little mermaid. And the fountain. I'm kind of thinking I should have bought some jet skis because my sons are more interested in the jet ski that we don't have the key to than the boat. So, <laughs> might be getting some jet skis. I got a cool little hammock right there. A little T dubs. Diesel, love you, man. Congrats on the baby. Give him a big hug and kiss for me. But well, we're going to get out of here, guys. Love y'all. 1970s W9. Hi from Michigan. What's up, Jeff? We're gonna get back in the house. And uh, we will see you guys. Might go live again tomorrow, who knows? See when my, maybe I'll go live tomorrow morning with my mom from the lake. That'd be cool, huh? God bless you guys, and see you soon.